Our final story is dedicated to every parent who ever had a kid who ever asked for a pet. Here's Steve Hartman on the road. 24 hours. For as long as her parents can remember, 11-year-old Brianna Carsey has had this crazy dream. Hmm? She has always wanted a brood mare, a mommy horse, that would give birth to a baby horse that would grow up to become a racing champion. Absolutely. This was a fairy tale for her from day one. We put it off for five years almost because we don't have a farm. So we got to go rent stalls somewhere. This sounds expensive. Yeah. Why don't you say no? Well, as she'll tell you, she has me wrapped around her finger. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> her foal, an Ohio standard bred, was born in the spring of 2013. She named it MJB Got Faith. MJB for the initials of the kids in her family, and Got Faith for the faith she instantly had in him. I really loved him. From the beginning? Mm hmm He's super soft, too. <laughs> Sweet. But that quick bond posed a real problem for this pushover dad. Come here, bud. See, for whatever reason, Brian thought once he explained to his daughter that her horse could never race, that it was a runt from poor breeding stock, she would just agree to sell it. But obviously not. <laughs> She's like, there's no price, daddy. So I'm talking to my wife. It's like, you know, we really got ourselves in a mess here. Yeah. And I don't know how we're going to get out of this. So we stake him to the races. This horse that doesn't belong in the races. The horse that I thought we should have gotten rid of already. <laughs> he was more about the money. What were you seeing that your dad wasn't seeing? He didn't believe in them. Brian was stuck, committed to boarding and training this long shot to end all long shots. Yep. And this is not a wealthy family. Brian runs a small logistics company, and Ohio Racing, which is harness-style racing, is a $900 million a year industry. I want to see him go fast. MJB Got Faith was so slow he barely even qualified to compete. But then somehow, someway, won his first race. Won his second race, his third, and his fourth, qualifying him for the state championship held recently in Columbus, Ohio. And I said, baby, if you finish third, you should be so thankful. She goes, Daddy, if he finishes last, I'm going to be thankful. But he's going to win. <laughs> and so it was that this little horse with no pedigree, this pet with no reason for being here beyond the blind faith of a little girl, won an Ohio Sire Stakes Championship. She said, Dad, I told you, you got to have faith. Brianna took home $100,000 that day. She has already given away half of it to charity. And as for the other half, she plans to use that money as a down payment on a farm. I just want to have a farm and be able to go walk out my back door and see him. And that's her plan for happily ever after. Just a girl, her horse, and knowing her father. Dad, can we please get a cat? No. Probably a cat. Two. Steve Hartman on the road in Connorsville, Indiana.